I <gasps> Someone's stealing Leah's phone. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Jess, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having a great day so far. For today's video, we are in a very special location. We are actually in Hawaii. I am here with the thrift queens, Alexa, Carrie, and Leah, and we're here for the next couple days to vacation and relax, do a little thrifting, go to the beach, adventure, and just have a good old girls trip, have some quality bonding. And today, we are kicking things off by doing what we do best, thrifting. Carrie and Leah are still getting ready in the car and Alexa and I are gonna head in first so let's head on in. Wait what is this? Who is she? Oh she's a hundred dollars. That's who she is. Oh my gosh. You go girl get that coin. Alexa and I have decided to head in first because we both have weak bladders and um, we have to we have to go. I hope they even have a bathroom. Here's to hoping we have found the bathroom. Yes. Oh my goodness. I am unlocking a childhood memory that I, I'd forgotten. I don't, what was it, 2XL? Is that what this is called? The stickers aren't in the way, but I had this. I think you can play cassette tapes. And this was one of my favorite like toy slash things that I had as a kid. Did, did anybody else have these? Do you guys even know what this is? Comment down below if you know what it is. Hello guys, I've returned. Business has been taken care of and I feel so much better. Um, but anyways, we went, we grabbed some carts and now we're just like hanging out in the Halloween aisle while we film our little pieces of the vlog. As we were walking to the bathroom, my first impressions of this Savers is that it is an amazing Savers. It is so clean and organized and they have a great selection of things. There's so many colors and it looks really good. I'm very excited to peruse. This is going to be so freaking fun and um, fun fact for you guys I'm actually running on two hours of sleep from the night before I didn't sleep last night before the flight and then I took like maybe like a four hour nap during the day and then the night before I slept two hours so collectively I'm running on like six hours but not sleeping last night I don't know basically I'm super jet lagged from my Philippines trip and then I'm just running on adrenaline and just nothing I don't know so we'll see we'll see if I make it today We'll see if I collapse. Who knows? Let's let's get crazy. Alexa is so cute. Wait, how is Alexa so cute? We are gonna kick it off in women's sleeveless tops. The first thing that has drawn my eye is this little green, kind of like intricately detailed uh, embroidered cami. And I think this is just so stinking cute. I'm gonna try it on because, why am I out of focus? What is this? There we go. I'm gonna try it on because just looking at this, even though it is quite cute to be realistic, I just don't know if it would fit my chest because mm, I just don't know if it would. So I'm gonna try this on, we'll see. I don't know, fingers crossed, because it is really, really cute. I'm here. It's I'm Leah. Hawaii. Hey, look how cute she is. I'm not finding too much else in women's sleeveless, so I'm gonna head into our next section. I'm gonna start looking at active wear. It's kind of nice. Ooh, these are cute. Ooh, and they're Nike. $6.99. I will try these on. They might be a little bit big. They're really cute. And they're Nike, so not too bad. Let's give these a try. More Nike. I don't love this color as much. It's kind of like a dark uh, olive green. Not my favorite, but these are quite nice. They just started playing Nile in the store. It's a sign. This is this is the place to be. I have this weird thing. If you guys didn't know, I'm a mask directioner. I have been for a long time and I will not get that up. It'll be always a piece of my heart. But I have this weird like uh, superstition almost that whenever a One Direction or One Direction member song comes on in wherever I am, that it's like I'm supposed to be here. It's like meant to be. So, I mean, a Nile song just came up. So I think I'm supposed to be here. Is that Carrie Dayton? Oh my gosh, it's Carrie Dayton! Oh my gosh! 
It's huge. Hi guys. <laughs> What's up? Hi. The queen. The queen oh herself. Gosh. How are you? Can you believe she got ready in a car? It looked like she- I feel so refreshed. You look amazing. Wow, thank you so much. Yes, of course. Get you a hype woman like Jess, honestly. Facts only. <laughs> what are you looking for today? Um, I don't know, like I'm kind of torn between if I want to go like the fall route mm -hmm. when we get home, mm -hmm. or if I want to like look for stuff to wear this week. I feel the exact same because it's like, I want to search for fall things yeah. because that's what I'm going to be using the most. But then also, I feel like it's just impractical because fall things are typically heavier. I don't really have any game plan. I'm yeah, just kind same. of browsing. Like, that's how I ran into you. I was just yeah. wandering. Yeah. We'll the, see. The, the real come up. Stay tuned. So I have been having quite the debate with myself. I'm trying to decide if I should allow myself to check out the home decor section because Savers always has such a killer home decor section. Their home decor section is unparalleled, in my opinion, to other thrift stores. And this one is quite a large Savers and the home decor section looks really nice. But again, to be realistic, I don't have the most space in my luggage. I left some space for weight, but not necessarily bulkiness. Do I let myself look and then maybe find something that can fit in my luggage and be super happy I looked? Or do I torture myself and look and find something perfect and amazing and then be sad because I can't take it home? What do I do? To be quite honest though, I am pretty weak and I'll probably end up looking anyways. I feel like this debate is just to make myself feel better like I actually thought about it, but you know, I'm gonna do it. This is me cracking. I've cracked. Say crack again. Crack. All right. Yo soy aquí. Dito no alcohol. I'm here. <sighs> Let's see what I find. What a cutie pie little dish. I don't need this, but I just wanted to show you how cutie it was. Oh, wow. A sign that describes my life. Love it. Ah, and another one. What? Oh my gosh, guys. Another sign that describes my life. Oh, and another one. You guys, I am in basket heaven. See, this is what I just wanted to see if they had any, but I wanted to be, I was very realistic that I couldn't probably get any because they probably wouldn't fit. But like, look at all these cutie pie baskets of all different kinds and shapes and sizes and styles. And this is cute. I like this one. <sighs> we'll stay, but. Quite appreciate. It's actually gone pretty good. This is my last aisle of the home decor section. And you know, one thing things that I really liked, I just, oh, not me. Oh no. Um, basically what I'm saying is I'm in the last aisle and I found a lot of things that I really liked and I thought were cute, but I, I'm okay walking away. All is well, things are good, and I'm happy I checked. Now I'm not gonna be thinking the whole time like, what if I had checked in the home decor section? What if I found something I loved? Now I know. No such luck in the men's t-shirt section. They're all kind of just, I don't know, mostly school shirts. You know how like, just like, this school's football or whatever, debate team. Okay, not to be dramatic, but there's like this man who keeps like kind of following me around the store, which at first it was like, oh, he's just in the same spot, but then it just kept happening. And now I feel weird. Oh my gosh, the song that's playing right now is that one NSA song, that the joke NSA song, the I'll be watching you. Wow, great timing, honestly. <laughs> Amazing. Really quick though, before I head into the fitting room, check out this uh, knockoff Demogorgon costume. That's called Abyssal Fiend. I don't think I gave you guys an OOTD, so today I'm wearing a nice denim on denim outfit. So I have this denim uh, cropped jacket that I actually found from my mom's closet. Shout out to my mom. These jeans are also from my mom's closet. Uh, these are both hers from the 90s, which is super neat, and she just like gave them to me. And I was just like, thank you, mom. I've got on some like Adidas running shoes just to, you know, stay comfortable while airport traveling. For my shirt, I'm just wearing a black lacy cami to add a bit of a feminine flair to this. A gold necklace from Lily Clasp. Gold hoops from Madewell. And then, oh, this is my second piercing. I haven't shown you guys yet. I got on my birthday when I was in the Philippines. Not stylized at all. I don't love this on me, but I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna see if it looks cuter. Stylized it a bit, knotted the front and rolled up the sleeves a smidge. And I don't know, I really like the print, but I'm just not wild about the fit on this.
what is this? Who goes out on Halloween and is like, yeah, I'm gonna be a crow for Halloween. <laughs> You know how everybody has that one alcohol they can't drink anymore or smell anymore because of bad experience? This is mine. Work, work, work. Yes, yes. yes. Strut. Okay, oh, <laughs> there she goes. She ain't as young as she once was. Yes, yes, yes. Give it to us. Oh. Wow, <laughs> wow. There she goes. My <laughs> Strut, work. you're stuck. Oh, yes. Oh, she's giving us that. <laughs> Strut, you're stuck. Work. Hey. Yes. Woo! Yeah. Oh! <laughs> Sorry. Challenging. <laughs> okay. Bring it. Let's go, Carrie. Can you top that? Let's go. Ooh. Oh, shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. Yes. Woo! Yes. Oh, I like that. That was graceful. Amazing. Iconic. Oh, that's not. I like it. You have to do a strut. Do Sims walk. Oh, yes, Sims. Here we go. Oh my gosh, wait, is she winning? She's like... Wait, hold on. <laughs> that was good. Oh, Narga Plark, that was the best. Narga. That was the best. That was the best. Thank you so much. You are amazing. Yeah. I'm just gonna jump on in jump here. In, girl. <laughs> <laughs> Big smiles. Happy ladies. Thank you so much. <laughs> so we have some super bummer news. Um, while we were having our dance party, Leah set her phone down and then someone stole it. I feel so bad for Leah, but I don't know, she's handling it like a champ. She's amazing. Wherever Leah went, I don't know. What a day. What a day. What a day for old Leah. Alrighty guys, I am back home, back in Los Angeles, and it feels so good. Hawaii was so, so much fun, and we just had like a great time. Just being with that group of gals is the most positive, like girl empowering, just amazing fun time. Everything is funny, everything is crazy. We're always just doing wacky things, and it's, it's just a really great time. This is such a great, genuine friend group, and I just, I really love those gals. Carrie, Alexa, Leah, hey girls, love you. And I actually have a Hawaii vlog if you guys wanna check that out. It's part like lookbook outfits of the week, and then part vlog kind of following what we did, and there's also a giveaway in it that is for a Canon G7X, and then some other prizes, so I highly recommend you guys check it out. I'll be linking it down in the description box, and if you do wanna check out that giveaway, make sure you enter as soon as possible because it ends on September 30th so make sure you go enter because a free camera is you know a pretty great thing so make sure to check that out linking it below but anyways back home feeling very fall I'm super into it so now that I've chatted your ears off for a good cool minute gave you the updates filled you in on things I guess I probably should get into the haul portion because that's what you're all here for my haul from Hawaii is not big it is only I think five or six pieces if you guys want to see a big thrift haul I have a massive one with over 20 items coming up in the next like week or so so keep an eye out for that but this haul is relatively small because I did not have very much room in my bag hopping into the haul what would be a trip to Hawaii if I did not pick up any Hawaiian print shirts so the first thing I picked up is this beautiful red Hawaiian print button-up you guys know I have an affinity for button-ups, especially little short sleeve ones. I think they are so stinking cute. And I just, I love the color on this. I love the print on this. I think it's so fun. And I love kind of the more hand-drawn type of look versus more of like a, I don't know, printed kind of look. I just think it's very beautiful. Next, we have another Hawaiian print button-up. And this one is also in a shade of red. This one definitely leans more on the pink spectrum versus like red, red. And again, it's just a Hawaiian print button up, short sleeve. This one though, I envision wearing it over some sort of like little bodysuit or tank top or strappy cami or something like that. And then the last Hawaiian print piece that I picked up is this beautiful green Hawaiian print dress. I think this is so beautiful and so lovely. I absolutely adore the color that this is in and I love the cut and the style of this dress. I think it looks so beautiful and I actually really liked how it fit and sat on my body. I thought it just looked really nice. The next piece that I picked up is definitely a very summery type of piece or, you know, fall in Los Angeles type of piece. Is this little green intricately 
embroidered cami. I think this is adorable and so, so fun. The last clothing item that I picked up is definitely a very fall and I quite like it. I think it's adorable and I think it's quite reminiscent of Cher from Clueless. So that's pretty cool too. What I picked up is this yellow coat with plaid accents. I love the structure, the design, the style. I love how it has a very kind of almost like 50s, 60s air to it. Because of the style of this piece and the design, the buttons I also think are so beautiful. And then the last thing we have is something I actually actually forgot about until just a second ago and it's not a clothing piece but it's just a, a cute little thing that I saw. It's this little yellow picture frame that says friends at the bottom in a very Rugrats kind of looking type of way. This was $2.99 and the reason that I picked up this was because when we were in Hawaii I really wanted to take a picture that was of the four of us so I could just put it up and I could remember this trip for forever and always. I could put it up in my office somewhere and when I saw this I was just like that would be so special. And that was my haul from Hawaii. Why. I hope you guys liked it. I would love to know down in the comment section what your favorite piece was. I think mine. <sighs> Outerwear man, I definitely think mine was maybe that mustardy yellow coat tied with that green Hawaiian print dress because that is beautiful. So let me know what your favorites were in the comment section. Also make sure to check out Carrie, Alexa, and Leah's videos that I will be linking down in the description box of their Come Thrift With Me uh, adventure, their vlog, and also their haul so you can see what they picked up. Again, as I mentioned previously, I will be having a huge fall thrift haul coming up in the next week or so. And also make sure you guys check out that Hawaii vlog if you want to see what we got up to. That will be linked below. And also you should just watch it just so you can enter the giveaway for the Canon G7X camera. It looks like this. It's the vlogging camera that me and literally every other YouTuber uses in their videos. Make sure you enter as soon as possible because that ends on September 30th. So shoot your shot. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So let's hop on into our quote of the day segment. Today's quote says, breathe darling. This is just a chapter, not your whole story. I think that is, that's great advice guys. Stick by that. Whatever you're going through feels like it's going to last forever, but you just have to remember that it's just a time period. It's just a chapter of your book. You still have so many more pages to go, so many more chapters. Trust the timing of your life. Trust that everything is going to work out how it's supposed to. And remember that tomorrow is always a new day. Tomorrow's a new start. So keep all of that in mind as we go into the week. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I love you guys so, so much. And I will actually see you guys tomorrow for another video. And then on Wednesday for another, another video. Bye!